All right, let's go over how to actually create a portfolio of pictures um, so that your buyers can simply click on a link and see multiple photos. And you can do this all from inside your Gmail account at the click of a button. It's going to be very important uh, to putting a package together as an acquisitions manager. No pictures, no uh, clothes. Uh, no clothes, no money. <clears throat> and so we want to make sure that we put a complete package together. Once we get the contract on the house, we need to immediately uh, go by the house and get um, 20 to 25 pictures inside and out of the house. All of the good, the bad, and the ugly. And immediately email those pictures uh, to yourself so that you can put this package together like so. And so how are you going to do this? Let's go ahead and click on this link here. Uh, this email then you'll notice that when I click on my email it'll open up to all of the images that I have available uh, or as attachments that I may have sent to myself etc so these are um, pictures now I want you to notice that all of these pictures I can graze over them and uh, it'll highlight them now the most important thing is I can click on this little uh, Google Drive uh, app and it's in all white right now but if I click on it it gives me the opportunity to open this little uh, box area up. now what I want to do is actually scroll down and create a new folder okay uh, for this particular property address and the way I do it is I reference number and I do the property address so let's just say we're gonna do um, one two three four money lane so whatever the property address is and I create the folder and I simply move it to that folder and then I go to the next picture I click on the little white drive and I find the folder that I just created if this this uh, set of pictures is all for the same property of course and I find the folder one two three money lane I click on it and I move it to it and then I click on it and if this is the same one I move it to it and of course I need to scroll down so that I can move it to it and same thing here click on it move it and last one click on it find the folder and move it now once I do that I'm actually um, almost done I'm going to actually click on the little colorful Google Drive and I'm going to click on show in Google Drive once it shows in Google Drive I'm going to um, actually find the folder over to the left okay I'm not going to click on it I'm just going to click on this little drop down button here and when I click on this drop down button I'm going to click on where it says I'm going to highlight over where it says share and I'm going to click on it click on share <clears throat> and when I click on share it gives me the opportunity to get shareable link I want to make sure I click on get shareable link and I want to make sure that this says anyone with the link can view I'm going to show you the other option anyone with the link can edit you want to always make sure that it stays on anyone with the link can view and you're just going to simply copy the link okay you can actually highlight over this and hit control C at the same time to copy the link or you can hit copy link once you hit copy link you are done uh, you're going to go back to your email address and you can actually compose and send this uh, with the title of the property Memphis, Tennessee, me and the zip code. And then um, you're going to put all of that information there. Drop the link in there. We're going to send this to myself so you can see. But you're going to send this to JBJ Holdings. Uh, you're going to send this to the appropriate email JBJ Holdings or info at homes for 10k.com. And you're going to put this same information here. And then uh, let's see here. That's the address. You will say pics below, and you're going to say who the acquisition manager is. I am. You will say Brian, whatever, Johnson, or whatever. That's the acquisition manager, and then your information, your email address, and your phone number. So that if we need. Uh, to ask you any questions, we can contact you. Once you do that, 
Um, you have created the uh, PIX folder and one step closer to completing your file. Simply click on it and once uh, you send it, we're going to show you what it looks like when you send it. And you'll see that the link is in here. It just was sent. I'm going to click on it to open it up. And let's see what it looks like. When I click on it to open it up, it's going to open up all of the pretty nice looking photos. And you're going to be able to scroll through them. Uh, and if I was doing this from my phone, I can hit the next button. And I can hit the next button. I can hit the next button. And I can hit the next button. So um, I'm done uploading the photos. Of course, 